Good morning, brothers and sisters. We will now pray the Holy Rosary. Please kneel. O sacred feast, in which we partake of Christ, his sufferings are remembered, our minds are filled with his grace, and received the blessed glory which is, which is to be ours. You gave them bread from heaven to be their food. And this bread contained all goodness. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memory of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you want for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Queen of heaven, rejoice. Alleluia. For he whom we did marry to bear, Alleluia, has risen as he said, Alleluia. Pray for us to God, Alleluia. Rejoice and be glad, O Virgin Mary, Alleluia. For the Lord is truly risen, Alleluia. Let us pray. O God, who gave joy to the world to the resurrection of your Son, our, our Lord, Lord Jesus Christ, grant we beseech you that through the intercession of the Virgin Mary, his mother, we may obtain the joys of everlasting life through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The glorious mysteries, the first glorious mystery, the resurrection. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The second glorious mystery, the Ascension. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
none at the hour of her death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of her death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of her death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The fifth glorious mystery, the coronation of Mary. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of your womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother, Mother of, of mercy. mercy. Hail, Hail our life, our sweetness, and our hope. hope. To you, you do we cry, poor banished children, children of Eve. Eve. To you, you do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, your eyes of mercy toward us. And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of your womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, Queen of the Holy Rosary of Manawa, pray for us that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech you that meditating upon these mysteries of the Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer to Saint Joseph. Behold the faithful and prudent steward whom the Lord has said over his household. The Lord has shown him his love and covered him with glory. He has clothed him in splendid garment. Let us pray. Father, you entrusted our Savior to the care of St. Joseph. By the help of his prayers, may your church continue to serve your Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Jubilee prayer for the golden anniversary of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, our Father and Creator, in whom we live and move and have our being, we praise you as we gather in general grace and gratitude on this jubilee of the Dominican province of the Philippines. O God, the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, we preach you as the way, the truth, and the life, whose name we proclaim, whose love we strive to incarnate. O God, the Holy Spirit, advocate and guide, we bless you and seek the outpouring of your presence in the witness of our words and works in the consecration of our lives to the holy preaching, in speaking only to you and about you, that our celebration be filled with fidelity to our mission, with hope for your promise, and with true charity binding us all, in the gospel we share to all peoples, by your will, O God, in your name, O Lord. Amen. Our Lady of the Holy Rosary, pray for us. Our Holy Father, Saint Domini, pray for us. Please be seated for a while. 
Good morning, brothers and sisters. Welcome to the Minor Basilica of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Today is the Wednesday of the fourth week of Easter. We will now have the morning prayer of the Church integrated with the celebration of the Holy Mass. We invite you to actively participate in our prayers. Please stand. Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. The Lord is risen, alleluia. The Lord, the Lord is, is risen, risen alleluia. alleluia. Come, let us sing to the Lord, and shout with joy to the rock who saves us. Let us approach him with praise and thanksgiving, and sing joyful songs to the Lord. The Lord is risen, alleluia. The Lord is God, the mighty God, the great King over all the gods. He holds in his hands the depths of the earth and the highest mountains as well. He made the sea, it belongs to him. The dry land too, for it was formed by his hands. The Lord, the Lord is, is risen. risen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Come, then let us bow down and worship, bending the knee before the Lord our Maker. For he is our God and we are his people, the flock his shepherds. The Lord, the Lord is, is risen. risen. Alleluia. Alleluia. Today, listen to the voice of the Lord. Do not grow stubborn as your fathers did in the wilderness. When at Mary by Massa, they challenged me and provoked me, although they had seen all of my works. The Lord, the Lord is, is risen. risen. Alleluia. Forty years I endured that generation. I said, There are people whose hearts go astray, and they do not know my ways. So I swore in my anger. They shall not enter into my rest. The Lord, Lord is, is risen. risen. Alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord, the Lord is, is risen. risen. Alleluia. Alleluia. O God, arise above the heavens. Alleluia. My heart is ready, O God. I will sing, sing your praise. Awake my soul. Awake lyre and harp. I will awake the dawn. I will thank you, Lord, among the peoples. Among the nations, I will praise you. For your love reaches to the heavens and your truth to the skies. O God, arise above the heavens. May your glory shine on earth. O oh, come and deliver your friends, help with your right hand and reply. From his holy place God has made his promise. I will triumph and divide the land of Sechem. I will measure out the valley of Sukkot. Gilead is mine and Manasseh. Ephraim I take from my helmet. Judah from my commander's staff. Moab I will use for my washbowl. On Adam I will plant my shoe. Over the Philistines I will shout in triumph. But who will lead me to conquer the fortress? Who will bring me face to face with Edom? Will you utterly reject us, O Lord, and no longer march with our armies? Give us help against the foe, for the help of man is vain. With God we shall do bravely, and he will trample down our foes. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Lord will make praise and justice blossom before all the nations. Alleluia. I rejoice heartily in the Lord. In my God is the joy of my soul. For he has clothed me with a robe of salvation and wrapped me in a mantle of justice, like a bridegroom adorned with a diadem, like a bride bedecked with her jewels. As the earth brings forth its plants, and the garden makes its growth spring up, so will the Lord make justice and praise spring up before all the nations. For Zion's sake I will not be silent. For Jerusalem's sake I will not be quiet. 
until her vindication shines forth like the dawn and her victory like a burning torch. Nations shall behold your vindication and all kings your glory. You shall be called by a new name, pronounced by the mouth of the Lord. You shall be a glorious crown in the hand of the Lord, a royal diadem held by your God. No more shall men call you forsaken, or your land desolate, but you shall be called my delight, and your land espoused. For the Lord delights in you, and makes your land his spouse. As a young man marries a virgin, your builders shall marry you, and as a bridegroom rejoices in his bride, so shall your God rejoice in you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Zion, the Lord your God, will reign forever. Alleluia. My soul give praise to the Lord. I will praise the Lord all my days. Make music to my God while I live. Put no trust in princes, in mortal men in whom there is no help. Take their breath, they return to clay and their plans that they come to nothing. He is happy who is held by Jacob's God, whose hope is in the Lord's his God, who alone made heaven and earth, the seas and all they contain. It is he who keeps faith forever, who is just to those who are oppressed. It is he who gives bread to the hungry, the Lord who sets prisoners free. The Lord who gives sight to the blind, who raises up those who are bowed down, the Lord who protects the stranger and upholds the widow and orphan. It is the Lord who loves the just, but towards the path of the wicked. The Lord will reign forever, Zion's God from age to age. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Please stand. Let us pray. O God of life, of the faithful, glory of the humble, blessedness of the just, listen kindly to the prayers of those who call on you, that they who thirst for what you generously promise may always have the feel of your plenty through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Please be seated. A reading from the Acts of the Apostles. The word of God continued to spread and grow. After Barnabas and Saul completed their relief mission, they returned to Jerusalem, taking with them John, who is called Mark. Now there were in the church at Antioch prophets and teachers, Barnabas, Simeon, who was called Niger, Lucius of Syrian, Manain, who was a close friend of Herod the Tetrarch, and so. While they were worshiping the Lord and fasting, the Holy Spirit said, Set apart for me Barnabas and Saul for the work to which I have called them. Then, completing their fasting in prayer, they laid hands on them and sent them off. So they, sent forth by the Holy Spirit, went down to Seleucia, and from there sailed to Cyprus. When they arrived in Salamis, they proclaimed the word of God in the Jewish synagogues. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. O God, let all the nations praise you. O God, let all the nations praise you. May God have pity on us and bless us. May he let his face shine upon us. So may your way be known upon earth, among all nations, your salvation. O God, let all the nations praise you. May the nations be glad and exult, because you rule the peoples in equity. The nation on earth you guide. O God, let all the nations praise you. May the peoples praise you, O God. May all the peoples praise you. May God bless us, and may all the ends of the earth fear him. O God, let all the nations praise you. Please stand.
I am the light of the world, says the Lord. Whoever follows me will have the light of life. Lord be with you and with your spirit. A proclamation from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, O Lord. Jesus cried out and said, Whoever believes in me believes not only in me, but also in the one who sent me. And whoever sees me sees the one who sent me. I came into the world as light so that everyone who believes in me might not remain in darkness. And if anyone hears my words and do not observe them, I do not condemn him, for I did not come to condemn the world, but to save the world. Whoever rejects me and does not accept my words has something to judge him. The word that I spoke, it will condemn him on the last day, because I did not speak on my own, but the Father who sent me commanded me what to say and speak. And I know that his commandment is eternal life. So what I say, I say as the Father told me. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated. Tinukoy ng Panginoong Heso Kristo ang kanyang sarili na liwanag. Ang kanyang mga salita ay nagpapaliwanag upang matahak natin ang tamang landas pabalik sa ating Ama. At kapag kasinunod natin ito, sigurado, hindi lamang tayo ang maliligtas sabi niya, kasama nating maliligtas pati ang mundong ito. Bakit? Sapagkat siya'y sinugo dito sa ating piling, hindi upang kundinahin ang mundo, kundi iligtas ito. Paano? Sa pamamagitan natin. Sapagkat ang mundo ay nilikha ng Diyos para sa tao. Hindi ang tao para sa mundo. Kaya kung wasto ang pakikipag-ugnayan ng mga tao sa mundong ito, magiging mahusay ang takbo ng mundo. Kung hindi mahusay at hindi matino ang pakikipag-ugnayan ng tao sa mundong ito, hindi maliligtas ang mundo at kasamang mapapahamak ang mga tao. Hindi nyo ba nababasa sa una pa lamang na kabanata ng Henesis, yung unang aklat ng banal na kasulatan kung paano nilikha ang tao. Hinubog magmula sa putik, sa makatwid, galing tayo sa mundong ito. Kaya ang mundong ito at tayo ay iisa. Kaya kung ano nakikita nyo sa mundo, nakikita ninyo sa mga sarili ninyo. Kung ang mundo may kapatagan, o sa latin nyo yung katawan nyo, may mga kapatagan din. Kung ang mundo ay may kabundukan, o makikita nyo rin yung katawan nyo, may mga kabundukan din. Kung may damuhan, o oh, may mga damuhan din kayo. Kung merong mga isla na lulutang-lutang sa tubig, o magpa-ultrasound kayo, makikita ninyo. Yung mga nasa loob ninyo, makikita nyo para mga isla na nakalutang sa tubig. Kung may araw, may bituin, may liwanag, tingnan nyo yung mga mata ninyo. Makikita nyo ang liwanag. Sa makatwit, kung ano nakikita nyo sa mundo, makikita nyo sa sarili ninyo. Kaya kung magulo ang nangyayari sa mundo, eh yun ang dahilan ay sapagkat yung mga tao nagkakagulo. 
O kaya tingnan ninyo, hindi ginagalang ang mundo samantalang sila'y tinakda dito sa mundo upang iligtas ang mundo sa kanilang matinong pamumuhay. Eh, hindi matino ang kanilang pamumuhay, kaya pati tuloy yung kalikasan. Eh, hayan, nagkalitulito. O, kaya pag nakikita nyo, bakit ba nagkakaganito na ang takbo ng kalikasan? Eh, ano ba dahilan yan? Eh, nagbago na rin ang ugali ng tao. Nung araw, ang tawag nila sa kasal kalikasan, Mother Nature. Mother Nature. Inang kalikasan sapagkat siya nang tumutusto sa ating pamumuhay. Ginagalang sapagkat nanay. Meron ba namang nanay na nilalapas tangan? Ginagalang. Hindi inaabuso. O ay ngayon, hindi na tinuturing yung kaligtasan na nanay nila na ating pinanggalingan. Nilalapas tangan. Kaya, Nature stops becoming a mother. The mother becomes the mother-in-law. Nagwala ang kalikasan. Ay dahil na rin sa atin, hindi matino ang ating pakikipag-ugnayan sa kalikasan. Dapat sana tinatrabaho natin ang kalikasan, mga tamad. Katamaran ang nag -ahari. Eh, alam nyo naman, ang kalikasan matipid kapag ka hindi mo ginagamit, kukunin sa iyo. Ang kapatagan kapag ka hindi mo sinaka, eh, tutubuan lang ng damo. Matutuyo, magkakabitak-bitak. At ang daing luntian na bukid, nagiging disyerto. Eh, hindi mo ginamit eh. Matipid ang kalikasan pag hindi mo ginagamit, tatanggalin sa iyo. Maski naman sa ating katawan, pag hindi mo ginamit, kaya nga pinagagamit ng mahusay yung ating katawan. Hindi yun tayo tatamad-tamad, kailangan may ehersisyo. Maski yung ating kaisipan, kapag ka hindi mo pinagana, sabi natin, ay nako pupurol yung isip mo. Ayan. Yang memoria mo, kapag ka hindi mo pinalalakan, eh nako, baka demensya mangyari sa iyo. Oh. Ano pa? Ang puso, kapag ka hindi umibig, ano, tumitigas. Kaya lahat ng hindi ginagamit, tinatanggal. Pero kailangan gamitin mahusay. Yun naman. Eh, inaabuso. Yung iba naman, abusado. Hindi nga tamad, abusado naman. Tinatagpas yung mga punong kahoy sa kabundukan. Hindi pa lumalago, eh, putol na. O, oh, ayan tuloy, yan. Oh, binabaha tayo dito sa kapatagan. Kapag ka may bagyo, eh, hindi lamang ulan ang dala. May dalang putik. Muddy slide. Bakit? Inabuso natin. Yung iba tamad, yung iba abusado, sakim. Eh lahat ay eh, pagmamalabis yan kay Mother Nature. Kaya si Mother Nature, nagalit ng tulo yan. Ayan, naging mother-in-law, naging biyanan. Nagtataka pa ba kayo kung bakit kung ano-anong sumusulpot na mga sakit dito sa mundong ito? Hindi mo may paliwanag. Kinalikot natin eh. Hindi matino ang ating pakikipag-ugnayan. E samantalang ang Diyos binigay itong mundong ito na maganda. At sinabi sa atin, trabahuhin ninyo ito. Pagyamanin ninyo sapagkat ito ang bubuhay sa inyo dito sa mundo. Kaya doon sa unang aklat ng Henesis, makikita nyo doon. Sinabi na ng Panginoon, katiwala kayo. Makatwid, kung katiwala ka, kailangan may pagmamalasakit. Eh, hindi natin pinagmalasakitan. Hindi tayo nagtamara na nangyari, inabuso natin yung mga ibubunga sana ng kalikasan. 
kaya heto kung ano yung gulo sa ating puso at kalooban sa ring gulo na nakikita natin sa labas ng ating kalooban ng ating kalikasan o ano pa ang salita ng Diyos na nagpapaliwanag sa atin? Hindi lamang tayo anak ng mundo sapagkat galing tayo sa putik. Doon sa ikalawang kabanata ng Henesis, para tayo mabuhay, hiningahan tayo ng Diyos. <sighs> sapagkat wit, binuhay tayo ng kanyang sariling espiritu. Ano ba yung espiritu ng Diyos? Spiritu ng pag-ibig. Pag-ibig. Hindi tayo mabubuhay lamang na kain, tulog, kain, tulog. Hindi. Mabubuhay tayo sa pag-ibig. Sapagkat yon ay Espiritu. Hiningahan tayo ng Diyos para mabuhay sa pamamagitan ng Kanyang Espiritu. At ang Espiritu ng Diyos ay pag-ibig. Kung ang kalikasan gagamitin mo, yung kapwa-tao mo, wag mong gagamitin. Sapagkat ang pag-ibig, hindi gumagamit. Ang hirap nito, binabaliktad natin. Yung mundo, mahal na mahal natin. Kaya pa na yung kabig natin eh. Inaabuso natin. Pinagsisilbihan natin. Nagpapaalipin tayo sa mundo. Mahal natin ang mundo. Mahal natin ang mga binibigay ng mundo ang pera, ang kayamanan, ang kapangyarihan, eh kung ano daw ang mahal natin, nagiging kamukha tayo ng minamahal natin. Kaya kung mahal na mahal mo ang pera, magmumukha kang kwarta. Ano nangyayari sa atin? Nagsisilbi na lang tayo, puro pera. Kaya ang tanong natin sa buhay natin ay dalawa lang. Mapagkukwartahan ba yan? Makakain ba yan? O yun lang ang tanong natin. Ang pag-ibig, iba. Ang pag-ibig galing sa Espiritu ng Diyos. Eh hiningahan tayo ng Diyos ng kanyang buhay, ang pag-ibig. Sa makatwid, nung at maibahagi sa atin ang pag-ibig ng Diyos, naging kamukha tayo ng Diyos. Kaya tayo kawangis ng Diyos sa pamamagitan ng pag-ibig. At ang pag-ibig, hindi gumagamit. Hindi mo ginagamit ang kapwa mo. Hindi mo ginagamit yung mga anak mo. Ano, paano nyo ginagamit mga anak nyo? Eh, mga anak nyo ba, parang baboy na pinalalaki nyo at pag mataba na, ipagbibili nyo. O yung iba, gano'n na isip sa mga anak, puhunan. Tinatakwil kapag wala nang makuha dun sa anak. Laki, para na kasi puhunan ng tingin doon sa mga anak. Ay naku, ang pagmamagulang ha, talagang yan, elogi kayo. Kung hindi mo lang talaga mahal, bakit mo pakakainin yan? Bakit mo pagtsitsagaan yan? Nakadalas rin sagot ng sagot. O, yan, o. Ang pag-aasawa, palugi yan. Pagka kayo nag-asawa, hindi kayo nag-asawa sapagkat Meron kayong makukuhang tubo. Pinakasalan niyo ba yung asawa niyo? Dahil meron siyang pamana na kukunin. Na kahit na pangit, matanda na. Pinakasalan niyo dahil ang tingin niyo sa kanila, eh, yung dollar sign, o peso sign. O gagamitin niyo yan. Hindi ganyan ang pagtrato sa tao. Ang tao tinatrato ng pag-ibig. At tagpag-ibig, hindi gumagamit. O, kaya pag nakakita kayo ng tao at inibig nyo, pag-ibig din yan sa Diyos. Ang pag-ibig na tunay sa tao ay pag-ibig sa Diyos. Kaya nga yung dalawang yun, hindi pwedeng paghiwalayin. Pag-ibig sa Diyos at pag-ibig sa tao. Kung tunay kayong tao, kamukha kayo ng Diyos. At ang Diyos umiibig. Hindi nang gagamit ng kapwa-tao. Kaya mamili kayo. Kayo ba anak lang ng mundo? Eh, hindi maililigtas ang mundo. Mauuwi lahat tayo sa putik. O kaya pinili nyo tayo maging anak ng Diyos. 
Pati itong mundo ito'y maililigtas sapagkat hindi lang tayo mahusay gumamit. Mahusay tayo magmahal ng ating kapwa-tao. At ang pag-ibig sa tao ay pag-ibig din sa Diyos. Oh, let us all stand to offer our prayers. For every intention, we are going to say, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That our Pope and bishops may continue to proclaim the good news of Christ's resurrection. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That government officials may imitate the compassion and gentleness of Jesus in caring for the least of his brethren. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That people in nations afflicted by po poverty may be drawn to Jesus who became poor for our sake. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick and those who find life burdensome may see God's special love and care through the concern of their families. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For Pope, the College of Bishops, parents, relatives, benefactors, and all those whom we promise to pray, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the prior provincial and for our brothers and ministry at Bay Dominico and St. Mary Magdalene, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the intentions of the devotees and pilgrims of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag and for our personal intentions. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. That the faithful departed may be raised up to eternal joy in heaven. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Almighty Father, grant us a loving heart, a loving heart that respects and cares for with unconditional love our fellow men in the same manner that you have loved us without any condition. Until eternity, we ask this in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Please be seated. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this bread to offer, which earth has given, human hands have made. This will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to offer. Through the divine and works of human hands, this will become our spiritual dream. Blessed be God forever. Please stand. Pray, my dear friends, that our sacrifice may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of His name, for our good and the good of all His Holy Church. O God, who by the wonderful exchange effected in this sacrifice have made us partakers of the one supreme Godhead, grant we pray that as we have come to know your truth, we may make it ours by a worthy way of life through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just our duty and our salvation at all times to acclaim you, O Lord, 
but in this time above all to love you more gloriously when Christ our Passover has been sacrificed. For with the old order destroyed, the universe cast down is renewed, and the integrity of life is restored to us in Christ. Therefore, overcome with paschal joy, every land, every people exalts in your praise, and even the heavenly powers with the angelic hosts sing together the unending hymn of your glory as they acclaim. Are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like the dew fall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and giving thanks, he broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. As we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francisco, our Pope, Socrates, our bishop, Idelis, our auxiliary bishops, Gerard, the master of the order, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection, and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Saint Joseph, our beloved spouse, with the blessed apostles, Saint Dominic and Saint Francis, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Please stand. 
Let us pray for the coming of the kingdom as Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who saith your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. We offer one another the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Please kneel. Behold, this is Jesus, the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are we who are called to this communion. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Please stand. I am the light. I have come into the I have come into the world that those who believe in me may not remain in darkness. Alleluia. 
Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets, he promised of old that he will save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us, to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. I am the light, I have come into the world, that those who believe in me may not remain in darkness. Alleluia. Let us pray. Graciously be present to your people, we pray, O Lord, and leave those you have imbued with heavenly mysteries to pass from former ways to newness of life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us turn to Mary, help of Christians, for the increase of priestly vocations in the church in Lingayen, Dagupan. Let our answer be Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You accompanied your son on his way to Calvary. Walk with our seminarians in their journey of priestly formation. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You are the mother of the Good Shepherd. Inspire our youth to follow the voice of your son and courageously answer his call to be shepherds. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. You were with the apostles in prayer on Pentecost Day. Stay with us in prayer so that the fire of the Spirit may descend on our young men seeking their vocation in life. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Your Son entrusted to you the beloved disciple at the foot of the cross. Take into your immaculate heart our young men who are reluctant to answer the call to be priest. Mary, help of Christians. Grant through your prayers many vocations to the priesthood. Let us pray. Mary, help of Christians, we place all our young men under your motherly protection. Inspire them to serve the church as priest of your Son. Take under your motherly care as seminarians, be informed for the priesthood. Accompany with your help your priest sons as they follow your son who is Lord forever and ever. Amen. Kami po ito sa puso nagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat na nakipagkaisa at nakasidalo dito sa pagdiriwang ng Santa Misa na way pagpatuloy nyo ang pagdarasal para sa aming naglilingkod sa inyo dito sa Basilica Minore of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. Makakaasa kayo. Magpapatuloy din kami ng pagdadasal para sa inyo at sa inyong mga pamilya. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Let us go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Now please join me as we pray for the blessing of the sick, as well as pray for the blessing of rosaries and other religious articles. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. God, our Almighty Father, by your blessing you give us strength and support in our frailty, turned with kindness toward our sick and aging brothers and sisters. Free them from all illness, restore them to good health through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag, so that in the sure knowledge of your goodness, they will gratefully bless your holy name. We ask this through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. In memory of the mysteries of the life, death, and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, and to the honor and glory of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of Christ, 
Mother of the Church, Our Lady of the Rosary of Manawag. May these rosaries, images, candles, all and other religious articles be blessed and made holy. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.